Dear friends, today I'll be reviewing Tees Rebel. I just have the shimmer lotion. Um, I'll show you what the shimmer looks like on, on your skin. You can kind of see it. And then, hold on, earlier I used it in the shower, even with my clothes over it. It still didn't quite rub off. Well, I could see it better in person, probably under the light. You kind of see it sparkle on my arms. It's not like a strong glitter, it's just like a light shimmer. So it's really pretty. I love that uh, shimmer lotion. A lot of people don't like uh, glittery stuff, but I love it. And this one, when I used it out of the shower, it all smelled fruity like star fruit or some kind of citrusy grapefruit smell, kind of like bombshell has in it. But then it quickly turned into a powdery scent. Um, the main no, and it I think is violet. Uh, so violet tends to be very powdery kind of floral scent. Smells like a uh, rush. If you've ever smelled rush, it's a popular scent that they always bring back, and they might even have it now. Or angel perfume. I have this one right here. I had it at the semi annual sale last year. Um, this one has a lot of violet in it, but I like this one a little bit better. I don't know. They're both pretty good. It's not a bad scent. It's just not my favorite. It smells like Wicked when I put it on. It smells really good when you first put it on, but after a while it just gets too sweet and powdery for me. But I think you guys will like that because I did like Wicked at first and um, Rush at first, but then it's kind of like a love-hate relationship for me because sometimes I like it and then sometimes I'm like, Oh, it's too much. Um, here's Fragrantica. Has, um, it says, Tease Rebel is an oriental floral fragrance for women. This is a new fragrance. Tease Rebel was launched in 2018. The nose behind this fragrance is Stephen Nelson. Uh, the fragrance features wild rose, violet leaf, violet, and leather. So I don't smell the rose in there at all. Uh, or leather. Giselle's Secret uh, reviewed this scent and she actually loves it. So it's pretty good. This is what the bottle looks like. And then the main accords right here is powdery, floral, leather, ozonic, rose, and aquatic. This is a uh, people voted on what they smell in, in this. I'm not sure if it shows how many people voted. It does somewhere, but I'm not going to keep it. Oh, total people voted 59. So they said, this is how many people loved it, how many people liked it, and this is how many people disliked it. It's a winter, it's not a winter smell. Most people voted it's a daytime smell uh, and spring. I think it's like a cozy scent, I don't know. I'll be wearing this before I go to bed. It's just really cozy because it's so soft and like powdery. But uh, I think that's it for this scent. Tomorrow I'll be reviewing Dream Angel. I already reviewed it once, so you can look up uh, um, Dream Angel review, and you should see that there. But I just had—I think I just had the Rollerball, so it'll be a lot different once I use it in the shower. Because when I first smelled this one out of the Rollerball, um, I didn't think it smelled anything like it does now. So I don't know how to get my videos to show all of my videos on my page. I have to figure out this YouTube stuff. I'm not very good with technology, but um, I'll do that. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day or night. Love, Amber.